What's the video of isofan from TechCycle? We talked about some of the basics of virtual exposed, how to install virtual exposed, how to install module to virtual exposed, and a lot more on a virtual exposed video. If you didn't watch that video, click the card over there to watch that. On that video, we didn't go deep into security concerns regarding this virtual expose because at that time the thread was very small. There is no much deep info about the security of this virtual expose. As now the thread has become bigger, we got more details regarding the security of this virtual expose, and I need to finish what I started about the virtual expose. So let's get started. In this video, we are not going to look at any of the things. We are going to only look at and focus on the security of this virtual expose. So, on using the virtual expose at that time it was released, my first security concern regarding this virtual expose was that when I am installing this virtual expose, they are requesting for a lot of permission. Lot means a lot of permission. And it was a, it was my first security concern regarding this virtual expose. And now the OP that is the thread owner of this virtual exposed reply to that issue that virtual exposed is not requesting for all this permission virtual exposed don't need all this permission at least they need the storage permission to access the storage op didn't mention about that op said that the virtual exposed does not require any of the permission the virtual exposed is requesting for all this permission for the application that is going to be installed inside the application so that the which are exposed don't need to request for, for request for permission after every application is installed like that when we install instagram to this virtual exposed instagram need a lot of permission and when we install facebook to this virtual exposed facebook need a lot of permission so the virtual exposed is doing that it is requesting all the permission at the time of installing this virtual exposed so that our usage after installing this virtual exposed and installing application inside the virtual exposed will be smooth Oh. Second security issue related to this virtual exposed is that some of the antivirus is finding virus inside the code of this virtual exposed. That is, what to say? It's not that much because it's been like five months after the release of this virtual exposed. This virtual exposed is released on March. Till now, nobody can find any virus code or anything like that in the source code of this virtual exports so it's completely safe to install also xds editor in chief michelle raman posted on the xda forum post of this virtual exports that they did not rush into posting the post about this virtual exports they have done their homework they have done their calculation they got a green flag from germans sorry for the wrong pronunciation an xda portal forum moderator and a Exposed module developer that this project seemed legitimate and they trusted its analysis and they have posted that. Also, they didn't go for all its screen flag, they also checked the community. All the community member who tested this virtual exposed find this safe, so they trusted them. So this virtual exposed is completely safe. There is no security issue regarding the virtual expose, it's completely safe. So that's all about this video guys. If you think this video sucks, hit that button. If you think this video is awesome, hit the like button and stick with us so you might find something interesting.